Question number 10. When solid KClO3 is heated in absence of air, a mixture of two chlorine compounds in the mole ratio 3 to 1 is formed. Okay, the first condition is no O2. So the reactions happen without O2. The KClO3 will decompose and form two compounds only. And there must be 3 to 1 mole ratio. And the chlorine is the one only one that changes oxidation uh, state or oxidation number. Okay, what could be the oxidation numbers of the chlorine in the two compounds that are formed? And uh, for uh, these answers, all the oxidation numbers given, uh, it's better for you to deduce the uh, chlorine anion or the related anion, then you can uh, get the correct uh, equation. Okay, so for the A, since it's given positive 3, so we know that it must be ClO2 negative. Okay, why? Uh, I will show a few anion, then you know uh, what is, uh, what is uh, uh, the way to get the answer. For this O2, we know that is negative 4. Overall charge is negative. Chlorine must be positive 3. That's how we get this anion. Okay, another oxidation number is positive 1. So we know that it must be ClO negative. So means this one is negative 2. Overall charge is negative. This one must be positive 1. Okay, I hope you understand and get what I mean. Okay, if uh, if you try to use these two anion, okay, this anion means it will form this compound KClO two, for example, right, and this one will form KClO. Uh, this is the examples means the salt that will form. Okay, if you try to use these two to uh, construct the equation. Uh, in uh, involve the KClO3, uh, you cannot get 3 to 1 ratio, right? Okay, you can try, right? But I will show you the uh, the one that, uh, the only one that can form the correct equation. Okay, if you do it uh, for the B, B is positive 6, use the same method, then you can get ClO4 2 negative. Positive 4, you get ClO3 2 negative. Okay, the way to do is just follow the, the A that I told you just now. And after you get this, and you try to use the, the compound, the KClO3, you cannot get the, the correct mole ratio or you cannot get the balance equation. Only C will give you the correct answer. Okay, if C, because positive 7 is given, we know that the anion must be this. ClO4 negative. This is negative 8. Overall charge is negative. This one must be positive 7. And negative 1 is easy, means it's just a correct. And you try to use these two anion. The compound is KC, KClO4 for this one, KCl for this one. Okay, uh, so it's, it's this position, right? Uh, okay, sorry, okay, this one. So it's just, uh, okay, it's the same thing, right? Okay, so then you get uh, the correct equation. Means if you use uh, this, this anion, okay, which is this compound, and this anion, which is this compound, if you use KClO3, Okay, when this decompose from these two compounds, then you get 1 to 3 mole ratio. That's why you get C. Okay, I hope you understand. For D, uh, you just follow, you get these two uh, anion and the compounds. Uh, of course, this will not give the correct uh, mole ratio. Right, okay, that's all. Thank you.